Hey, good afternoon, Cardinal family. Mr. Porter here. Hey, just wanted to give you an update on a few items, maybe give you a little bit of uh, direction on where to look for some things and just a few quick school updates. So administration this week has been working really hard on getting some things organized and we appreciate all your patience and your time. And so with that being said, I'm going to start with, we've had lots of questions about online learning and we, we're excited that people uh, both students, parents, and families would like some access to some, some information. We know there's lots of things out there. We would like to direct everybody to our web page, so our website. So if you do not know what that website is, I have it right up here in our little toolbar. It's clarinda.k12.ia.us. If you go to this web page, you'll go, you can scroll down through the page. You'll see all types of good information. This is where we put all of our most updated information on COVID-19. This is anything that we're getting from Iowa Department of Public Health and Page County Health. So anything we get, we like to put that on there to share for you guys for, for, for as, as far as information. Also, under important information regarding school closings, if you click read more, should click uh, come up here. All right, there we go. You'll see a nice letter from Ms. Bergman, our school superintendent. Right above that, you'll see helpful hints for learning at home link. This is the link you want to click on. I believe as our page is scrolling, that link pops up as well. We have all types of learning for all different levels, all different types of things on here. As a parent, grandma, grandpa, daycare center, whatever you'd like for access, you can go on here. You can click one of the links have yourself access um, there's ideas for home workouts and exercises there's virtual field trips all types of things for everyone to explore and learn and try to continue our growth and learning while we're at home as we progress a little bit we'll have people adding things we've gotten a lot of this information from our wonderful teachers we've had ad administrators add some things as we get more stuff and more info, we'll add it to the page so you can keep checking for updates every day and working yourself through some of those items. And you know, none of this is homework. No one's turning anything in, nothing's graded. We just wanna provide something for you and a direction for you to have an opportunity to watch some videos, uh, maybe keep up to date on some math and some reading and, uh, you know, and obviously some movement. So this is a great time to be at home with family find some time for some exercise, and stay healthy. Back to our homepage, you will see, we also have some information about feeding our birds. Uh, we wanna clean up some information, clarify a little bit of information here. Um, they're gonna be, there's a survey here, so you can click to complete the food survey if you have not already. So we're working on, there are some duplicates on there and cleaning some things up. So we're providing a meal every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. It's located at the high school. All you have to do is drive up through the little circle drive, come through, stop, we'll deliver, you know, you can give a little wave, say three, two, how many ever, four, four family members, maybe there's seven kids. Uh, so we're gonna provide a meal for all kids, zero to 18 years old. Uh, they will get a they will get two lunches and two breakfasts. This will happen between 11 and 12 o'clock on Monday and Wednesday and Friday. You can grab, come. It's just a grab and go. You don't get out of your car. We give it to you. You move about on your way. So we hope uh, you guys take advantage of this. We want to make sure that our kids are well taken care of. And we appreciate our food service staff and our volunteers that are helping making sure those meals are possible for everybody. Uh, probably the last update that I have is Central Office, which is at McKinley Schools. So Friday, March 20th, which would be tomorrow, uh, that office will be completely closed. That means no phones in the district will be answered during the day. They're going to do a deep clean down at Central Office at McKinley tomorrow. So there will not be anybody there. So just wanted to kind of keep you guys updated on that. Also, we're trying to do the best we can to not have anybody in the building. So right now it's just uh, essential staff, making sure our uh, administrators can get in the building, making sure our food service so we can provide the meals. And then of course our custodial staff so they can keep and continue to clean. Um, I hope that answers some of your questions. Uh, we appreciate your patience and hope you're enjoying your short little break. Have a good evening.